this is just going to be a quick full body workout. So to start with, we're going to come up and do some stretches. So we're just going to stretch the hamstring first. We're just going to be on a medium spring. So bring one leg forward, bring this foot a fair way forward. So it's almost in line with this rail, the ankle. Then gently going back, straightening this front leg first. Then folding the body towards that rail, feel it go into that hamstring, pushing down through those toes as well. Going to where you can feel that stretch the most. Having two breaths there. Hips are still facing forward. Relax shoulders. Then roll back a little bit further, putting a bit more pressure on it. Fold a little further forward, having another two breaths. Then gently coming back in. Then we'll swap sides. Bringing that foot forward. So the toes are just in front of where the braille is. Then gently straightening that front leg first, pushing down through those toes, then folding that chest forward. Feeling it go all down the back of this hamstring. Hips are facing forward. Watch how it twisted that body. Shoulders are relaxed away from the ears, but not dropped. They're back in the socket. Pushing those toes down, having two breaths there. And pushing a little bit further if you can, folding that chest down a little more. Hips are facing forward. Then gently coming all the way back in. Then we're just going to go on two medium springs. Coming laying down onto our back. those heels on the bar, tuck those shoulder blades together, ribs are drawn together a little, you've got that little curve through that middle back and that's that nice neutral spine. Heels are on the bar, then inhale, exhale, squeeze bottom, press back, down your tummy comes in, and inhale, gently release. Exhale, squeeze, and gently release. And watch not tightening the shoulders. Exhale, squeeze. So it's just that bottom half. And gently release. Exhale, squeeze. Bottom press back down. And gently release. Exhale, squeeze. And gently release. Gently release. Exhale out mouth, squeeze bottom, press back down. And gently release. Then we're going to do pelvic roll ups. So we're going to inhale while we're down, exhale, squeeze bottom, hollow tummy out, slowly rolling up. And if your hamstrings grab too much, you can add an extra spring on that. So just add a light one and see if it relaxes those hamstrings a bit and you can get the glutes on a bit more. Then gently rolling it back down. Exhale, rolling up. And slow and controlled as we roll all the way down through each vertebrae. Try not to roll the carriage out. Exhale, squeeze, bottom hollow, tummy out, pushing up. And slowly rolling it all the way back down to neutral. Exhale, rolling up. Slowly rolling it all the way back down. Exhale, rolling up. And then inhale, slow and controlled back down. Pushing through the back of those shoulders a bit. So the back of the arms and the back of the shoulders. Exhale, squeeze, bottom, hollow, tummy out. Rolling up. Shoulders and backs nice and active. 
and then gently rolling it down. Exhale, rolling up. And slowly rolling it back down. Last three. Gently rolling it back down. Exhale, rolling it up. Slow and controlled as we go down. One more. And slow and controlled as we roll it back down. Then we're going to roll back up, holding it up. Then we're going to roll out and roll back in. So we're going to go, exhale, squeeze bottom, hollow tummy out, rolling up to where you can hold it. Gently rolling out away. Inhale, rolling back in. Keep that bottom up. Exhale, going out. Gently coming back in. Exhale, going out. Tummy's on, glutes are on, spine's nice and long. Gently coming in. Exhale, push. 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 Gently coming in. Last two. Exhale, going out. Gently back in. Tummy's on. And rolling all the way back down. So just hugging those legs in. Just lengthen through that spine. Have three breaths there. Relax the shoulders. One more breath there. Then gently bring feet back onto the butt. We're going to roll to the side or just come sitting up however is easiest for you. Changing the springs to one medium, one light. If you have shoulder injuries, but just go on a light one. So you get sore at the moment. We're going to grab those straps in our hands. So then make sure shoulder blades are tucked together. Hands are just below your shoulders. Then pressing that lower, so if you relax through that spine, you're in that nice neutral, then press that lower back down just a little. You feel that tummy comes on. Then gently lift left leg. Feel those abdominals are on. Gently back down, just resting the heel on the bar, but not pushing. Exhale up, so all the way from the hands. Gently back down. Exhale up. 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 Gently back down. Gently going up with right, up with left, holding it there. Exhale, sweep hands to hips. And slowly coming back. Exhale, going down. Gently coming up. Exhale, down. Gently coming up. Exhale, down. Gently coming up. Gently pressing that back down, keep that tummy on. Exhale, pull. Gently coming back. Exhale, down. Gently coming back. Last two. Gently coming up, keep that tummy on. Gently coming back, resting right heel, then left. Then let it roll in for a second. Then we're going to come back up into tabletop. So pulling the weight back onto the hands. Gently bring left leg, then bring right. We're going to squeeze them together on this one. We're going to curl the head up. If you've got neck problems, like if you've got a sore neck or anything, you can put the block 
on to your head. So if you're having your yoga block, just put it behind the head. So that it's just behind your neck. So watch that you make sure it's just the base of your skull that's resting on it. So it's not pushing into your neck. Then you would just have it like that. Then you're going to just go exhale down. Whereas if you want to, you'll curl that head up. So pressing back down, legs are in tabletop, tummy's on. Exhale, slowly curling up. And gently coming back. But the block will help you still get your abdominals on more. Exhale, going down and you'll just do the arms. And gently going back. Exhale, going up. But if you want to, you can just do two raising the head and then two without raising the head. And just keep alternating. Exhale, curling up. Draw those ribs together. And slowly coming back. Keep tummy on. Exhale, curling up. Slow and controlled back. Exhale, curling up. Slow and controlled back. Exhale, curling up. Gently coming back. Last two. Gently coming back. Exhale, curling up. Gently coming back. Resting feet all the way down. Then we're going to bring knees and feet hip distance on the next one. Just do whatever's best for you. If you have a sore lower back, then don't extend the leg and you'll just frame the opposite. So you'll just go like that. If you don't, that I don't have a sore lower back, you can push out. But if you want to try pushing out, just go a bit higher if you find it hard to hold that tummy on. So we're going to tuck shoulder blades together, make sure you're nice and even through that spine and comfortable. Pull down on those straps a little. Press your back down just a little bit, so it's just a millimetre, so you feel that lower tummy switch on, but your tailbone doesn't lift right up. Then gently lift right leg, then lift left. Now we're going to go exhale, gently framing left leg, pushing right leg out. And inhale, slow and controlled back. Exhale, framing right. And gently coming back. Exhale, framing left. And gently coming back. Exhale, framing right. Gently coming back. Now you're going to curl head up if you want to. Exhale, framing left. And slow and controlled back. Exhale, framing right. Gently coming back. Exhale, framing left. Gently coming back. Exhale, framing right. Slowly coming back. Exhale, framing left. Gently coming back. Exhale, framing right. Gently coming back. Exhale, framing left. Gently coming back. Exhale, framing right. Do the best you can. Keep that tummy on. Gently coming back. Rib tip connection. Gently coming back. Keep ribs to hips. Exhale, going up. Slow and controlled back. Exhale, open. Slow and controlled back. Exhale, open. So if you want to leave that head down, you can still do that leg. Or you can just keep framing each leg. Last two. Last one. Gently coming back, resting it all the way down. Then we're just going to put the straps back on the shoulder rest. Then just come up sitting and just change it to two medium springs and a light. And then come laying back down. Then we're just going to have the heels on the bar. Then try to keep that spine nice and neutral. We're going to go exhale, pushing out. And gently coming back. Exhale, push. And gently back in. 
Feel your tummy flatten out. Gently coming in. Keeping hips nice and neutral. Exhale, pushing out. Gently coming in. So it's okay if you've got that curve in the middle back. Exhale, push. Gently back in. slowly in, exhale out, gently back in, last two, gently back in, and just make sure you've got enough room for those shoulders to shuffle down a little, then having the arms up in the air, we're going to go exhale push out, inhale going out to the side with the arms, exhale coming back, Gently coming back in. Exhale, push, keeping nice neutral spine. Inhale, out to the side. Exhale, coming back. Gently back down. Exhale, push. Inhale, out. Exhale, coming back. Gently back down. Exhale, push. Inhale, out. Exhale, coming back. Gently back down. Exhale, push. Inhale, out. Exhale back, inhale back down, exhale out, inhale to the side, exhale coming back, gently back down, last three, inhale out, tummy's on, exhale coming back, gently back down, inhale out, exhale coming back, gently back down, now just slide those heels to the outside edge, of the rail and then have those feet on the 45, hands are still up, exhale pushing out, inhale gently back in, exhale push, gently back in, hips are still nice and level, watch you don't swing through that back, exhale push, inhale all the way into the stopper, exhale push, Gently coming in, hips are nice and level. Exhale, push. Inhale, coming in. Now we're going to push out. Inhale out to the side, exhale coming back, gently back down. Exhale, push. Inhale out, exhale back, gently back down. Exhale out, inhale to the side. Exhale coming back, gently back down. Exhale, push. Inhale out, exhale back, gently back down. Nice neutral spine, exhale, push. Inhale out, exhale back. Gently back down. And back down. Exhale, push. Inhale, out. Exhale, back. Keeping those ribs together. Gently back down. Last three. Inhale, out. Exhale, back. Inhale, back down. Inhale out, exhale back, gently back down. Exhale push, inhale out, exhale back, gently back down, resting at that. Then we're gonna just take that rail down. Then just go on to a medium spring and a light one. Then just come onto hands and knees, and we're gonna have the toes curled under. Then we're just going to lift the knees up. So we're going to go exhale, little lift of knees, and gently back down. Exhale, little lift. Gently back down. Exhale, little lift. Gently back down. Exhale, little lift. 
gently back down. Make sure we're not arched up through that back. Try and flatten those shoulders. Drawing shoulder blades together, draw ribs together. Exhale, little lift. Gently back down. Exhale, little lift. Gently back down. Now we're gonna add on to it. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, push out. Inhale, back in. Gently back down. Then we're gonna push for two. Inhale, lift, tummy's on. Exhale, push. Inhale, back in. Exhale, push. Gently back in. Rest back down. Gently lift knees. Exhale, out. Inhale, back in. Exhale, out. We're gonna do three. Gently back in, rest back down. We're gonna do four. Do the best you can. Inhale, lift. Exhale, push. Inhale, back to the stopper. Exhale, push out. Inhale, back to the stopper. Exhale, push. Gently back in. <sighs> Gently back in, rest down. Last one. Doing five. Inhale, up. Exhale, push. Gently back in. Exhale, push. Gently back in. <sighs> Gently back in, resting it down. And then just have a rest for a second. We're gonna take the yellow spring off, or um, light spring. Take your knees a bit wider than hips. Toes are just gonna go together. Sit back into the hips. Then just let it roll out, bringing that chest down. Just have three breaths there, keep the tummy on. One more breath there. Then gently coming back up. Then just change it back, add that yellow one or the light spring back on. Come back to the same position. We're going to gently lift up through the heels and then try and keep the carriage still so you'll feel your lower tummies on. Coming up into a downward facing dog. Keep that carriage nice and still. Watch it doesn't roll away. Having three breaths there. Gently coming back down. If you can't do it on wrists, then you'll go on elbows. Lift bottom up. Same thing. Try and relax shoulders away from the ears. Shoulder blades are drawn together, ribs are drawn together. And gently coming back down. Then we're just gonna change the spring to one light spring. Grab that block for the head. Just remember it's really light while you're trying to move. Come laying down on your side. Then grabbing that strap from behind your head and just side lying. So just watch them push that shoulder right forward. Just gently come down laying and the shoulder will just come a little bit in front. Then find a comfortable spot on this underneath hip. Some people it's a bit forward, some people it's a bit back or straight. So find your best spot because everyone's different. Then having that hand on the shoulder rest, inhale. Then we're gonna go, so if you've got shoulder injuries, you might need to start just below the shoulder and then go down and just go up to where you feel that it feels comfortable through the shoulder, then rest the legs down. If you don't, roll it in, that hand will be up, inhale. Exhale, drawing ribs together, lift that, those legs, use that underneath inner thigh, sweep that hand to hip, and gently going all the way up, rest those legs down. Exhale, lift, and gently coming back, rest down. Exhale, lift legs, sweep hand to hip. Inhale, slowly coming back. So really drawing those ribs in together and down towards hips. Exhale, lift. Gently coming back. And then if you want to add on to it, you're going to go exhale, lift, sweep hand to hip. Slide hand down that leg. Really draw that rib to hip here. Then gently coming back with the head and arm and roll in. Rest the legs down. Exhale, lift legs, sweep hand to hip. Slide hand up, 
Gently coming back and going up and rest down. Gently lift up. Sweep hand to hip. Lift head, slide hand. Gently slide hand back. Gently coming up. Rest back down. Last two. Gently lift up. Sweep hand to hip. Slide that hand. Gently coming back. Coming up with that hand, rest legs. Last one. Gently lift up, sweep hand to hip. Use that inner thigh of the underneath leg. Exhale, slide. Gently coming back, rest head, bring hand up, rest feet down. Perfect. Then putting that strap back on the shoulder rest. Rolling over. So then grabbing the strap from behind the head. Then just make sure you're comfortable on the underneath shoulder, you haven't pushed it too far forward. That neck's nice and neutral, looking out forward. Inhale. Exhale, drawing those ribs together, sweep hand to hip. Inhale, slowly going up, rest feet down. Exhale, gently lift. Remember, watch that shoulder, go to where it's comfortable for you. Gently coming up and rest back down. Exhale, drawing those ribs together. Sweep hand to hip. Inhale, going up. And rest feet down. Gently going up. Sweep hand to hip. Draw those ribs together. Gently coming up. And rest feet down. Now we're going to lift and slide. Gently lift those legs. Sweep hand to hip. Slide that hand. Gently coming back. And coming up. And rest feet down. Exhale, lift legs, sweep hand to hip. Lift head, slide that hand. Slide the hand back, rest head. Bring arm up, rest feet down. Gently lift and sweep hand to hip. Slide that hand. Gently coming back. And going all the way back, rest feet down. Exhale, lift, sweep hand to hip. Slide that hand, lift that head. Bring that head back down, slide the hand. Gently coming up. Rest back down, last two. Exhale, lift and sweep. Slide hand, gently coming back, angling all the way back, rest feet. Exhale, lift and sweep. Slide hand, gently coming back and up and rest feet down. Then putting that strap back on that shoulder rest. Then we're just gonna bring that rail all the way back up. Then just come sitting in mermaid. We'll add a medium spring so it doesn't slide around on us. We're just gonna take this leg back and just slide our bottom off. So if you have sore knees, you might need to bring that knee into the middle of the chest. Or if you can, you wanna try and bring it a little bit wider so we feel a bit of hip angle. Then just check your back knees in line with hip. Then gently going back. Tummy's on, feeling it in this front glute and hip a little. Poke the bottom back, tummy's on, shoulders are relaxed. Two breaths there. Then gently crawling back up on there. Get to mermaid, then flip the legs, then going back the other way. It's just good for the hips to go through both ranges. Coming back and gently folding forward. That bottom's just about off that edge. Chest is open, shoulders are relaxed. If it's too much on that hip, slide that knee in more till you get it just on glute. Let's hip. Having three breaths there, poke bottom back, tummy's on, neck's in line with the spine, watch that head hasn't fallen down or looking up too much and flexing, just nice and neutral. Then gently coming back up. Then we're going to come sitting in with mermaid. Then just change it to just a medium spring. Have the hand on the back side of the rail. 
Gently going over. And gently coming up. Gently going over. And gently coming up. Gently going over. Then twist to face down. Twist to face forward. And slowly coming up. Gently going over. Twist to face down with that chest. Twist to face forward. And slowly coming up. Two normal ones. Gently coming up. And gently coming back up. Then we're going to turn to face the other way. Sitting into mermaid, those hips are facing forward. Watch how it roll back through that pelvis. Pelvis is stacked and you're not arching the back. Draw that rib to hip connection, that spine's nice and long through that crown of the head. Gently going over. And slowly coming up. Exhale, going over. And slowly coming up. Exhale, over. Then we're going to twist that chest to face down, let that arm float with it. Gently twist to face forward and slowly coming up. Gently going over. Twist that chest to face down. Twist that chest to face forward and gently coming up. Gently going over. Gently coming up. Gently going over. And gently coming back up. And then you're all done. Well done. Thank you. Good job.